What's up, what up? It's your Teka Dude here. Ngayong araw, I'll be sharing with you kung bakit dapat nyo natigilan yung paggamit ng ganitong mga uh, charge adapters. Most likely nakagamit na kayo ng mga ganitong charge adapters. Well, actually kahit ako, guilty rin ako. Kasi by default, usually yung mga iPhone products before already includes this uh, handy adapter. Kasi USB port siya and napaka-compact niya lang. Dali niyan dalin. So, nakaka-tempt na lagi gamitin. But naisipan ko, once and for all, why not make a video experiment to share with you why you should not be using this one anymore this 2022. Bago tayo magsimula, just a short message from our sponsor. CDKoffers.com is an all-in-one website where you could buy licensed keys. Just simply look for whichever software games you're looking for. Click on the Buy Now button. If you want to make it cheaper, simply enter DUDE20 which is an exclusive discount code that will give you a 20% discount from your purchases. Then enter your payment details and you should immediately receive the key once the payment has been confirmed. After receiving the key, you can then activate your software or games instantly. In today's experiment, we are going to be comparing three particular charge adapters. This is first, of course, yung default na maliit na 5 volts 1 ampere standard adapter that was by default included before for free sa mga Apple products. Usually, meron na rin kayong ganitong mga charge adapters. Next, we are going to be comparing my uh, default and included uh, supercharger from Huawei. This is the 66 watts uh, supercharger ni Huawei. So ito yung 66 watts na supercharger ni Huawei. We're gonna be comparing this one with that particular adapter and also the Ace Fast Power Up adapter. So ito yung Power Up adapter ni Ace Fast which has actually an interesting feature. It has three ports right here and later it discuss natin kung anong purpose niya. So looking at the most essential aspect, this can charge up to 5 volts and 1 ampere. That's quite fixed and that's quite a pretty standard voltage and amperes for a USB port. Meanwhile, itong 66 watts na uh, charge adapter ni Huawei that says here, supercharge. Well, actually, I'm using this for years already and indeed talagang supercharger talaga siya. But this is most likely just compatible with Huawei uh, smartphones. So this can charge up to 11 volts and 6 amperes yung maximum niya. So it can output a maximum of 66 watts uh, power. So again, yeah, that's the Huawei uh, supercharger. Next, we have the Ace Fast. For the Ace Fast, it can support a maximum of uh, 20 volts at 3 amperes, which is equivalent to 60 watts of maximum power. So yan. We're gonna be conducting some sort of experiment to find out bakit kailangan nyo na itigil yung paggamit sa mga ganitong charge adapters. Alright, as you can see, this is our setup right now. So, on the leftmost part, you can see that this is the phone being charged using the Huawei Supercharger. And dito naman sa gitna is yung ating Apple Standard 5V 1A charge adapter. Pagdating naman dun sa right, this is the Ace Fast na power up adapter. So this is also using a Type C port. Looking at first at the Ace Fast power up charge adapter, it was able to charge 7% in 10 minutes, starting from 46% going to 53%. And also take note na ginamit nating charge connector dito is yung included na charge connector niya. Pagdating naman dun sa Apple na charger natin, which is only 5 volts and 1 amperes, it was only able to charge 4% in 10 minutes. So it started with 55% and natapos siya within 10 minutes ng 59%. Pagdating naman dun sa Huawei charger natin, it was able to charge 16%, yun yung highest compared to the other two chargers. Nagsimula siya sa 62% charge and natapos siya with 78% charge in just 10 minutes. To sum up the results of our experiment, at the end, we need to stop using this old 5V 1A adapter kasi ang tagal-tagal bago makapag-charge. And uh, we could now utilize actually the supercharging or fast charging technologies that are uh, quite readily available on our smartphones and as well as two charging adapters. Looking at the performance ni Huawei, it is indeed the top of the line when compared to the other charge adapters, the Ace Fast and the original uh, Apple 5V 1A standard charger. But that's quite expected already since I'm using a Huawei smartphone and I'm also using the original uh, charging cable and I'm also using the original uh, charge adapter which is the Huawei 66W supercharger. 
Pagdating naman dun sa AC Fast, it was able to beat up the 5V 1A adapter ni Apple which is the standard adapter. In the end, kailangan na natin talagang i-forgo yung mga ganitong standard adapters kasi mabagal siya mag-charge. So if you're still using this kind of charging adapter which is the 5 volts 1 ampere adapter or standard charger, maybe you should start considering to buy a fast charger or a super fast charger one for your smartphone. So that's about it. Hopefully now you have decided not to use any more this kinds of charger and hopefully you should now be utilizing fast charging technologies and chargers out there. Leave me your thoughts and comments down below and uh, if you haven't subscribed on this channel yet, hit that like and subscribe button to get more tech stuff like this.